Me personally, man, I don't think so. And that's a dangerous thing to do, actually, like having a woman coach an NBA team because you can look at it two different ways legally. And let's let's start with the legal part. Um, it's kind of then it's kind of playing with fire having a female in the man in the men's locker room. I have been in the NBA locker room before just for a little bit. Uh, those guys, th th those guys being there, um, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, they're talking like guys and stuff like that. Some of them they be like butt ass naked, go to the chat and all of that. Do you want to include a female coach into that? I don't think so. Then. Let's just say for the sake of the argument, they hire one of these girls, one of these women to coach. And let's say they fire her because she went 20 and 75, something like that. Now you're gonna you're gonna throw doubt these women's gonna have gonna start suing the league, talk about indiscrimination, stuff like that. And they they most likely will throw the sexual harassment in there just because. Let's say the general manager might tell her, might tell her, oh, you look nice today. It's oh, like we've seen that. We've seen stories like that every day. I don't know why NBA franchise would sign up for that kind of type, for that kind of activity. I wouldn't do it. Um, and number two, bro, man, it just, it's not a, when you hire a coach for somebody, I never made it to the NBA, nothing like that, but I play sports, high school level, and I got a scholarship and all of that, right? When you hire a coach, man, that man, that man's supposed to be the to lead man, bro. And I don't think a man gonna look into a woman to lead him. That just look crazy. It looks weird. Can that happen in a Fortune 500 company, like a uh, one of those company? I don't, I don't know what company you wanna name, makeup, whatever. Yes, I yeah. can see a woman be a CEO, stuff like that. We yeah. talk about sports here, bro. We talk about men getting paid 30, 40 million dollars. Do you honestly believe they're gonna they're gonna listen to a Five foot three women, come on, man. No, nah, yeah. that's not gonna happen. It's yeah. kind of like the army. In the army, I don't know if the, the rules still exist, but in the army, before women couldn't be generals because, like, you're supposed to have a, a man, a masculine alpha, straight dog as a leader, bro. And women don't got that kind of that, 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 that kind of that kind of attitude like that. Imagine a woman trying to tell Kevin Durant or LeBron, like, have to run's plays. It's stuff like that. I don't think they would listen to. Right, because he barely listened to the coaches he got now. Exactly. Yeah, and then, and so, and the thing about it is, when you hire a coach, you want to hire someone that is a leader amongst men. And that's why it's important of who you hire, you know, because they don't respect certain coaches in the league and they respect other coaches in the league because of what we would define their alphaness, right? And so it might be a little hard to understand men in that fashion where a woman might come from a different perspective, more um, emotional perspective. And, exactly. and, and and then that may soften the game to some degree. Um, so I don't think I think as far as like the the camaraderie and all that and the there's the vibe and then how the continuity of the team, I think it could have some. Uh, potential harmful things to um, to, to occur because, like you said, all it takes is one sexual allegation, and that's it's, it, bro. It's over. It's it's over. You know what I'm saying? All right. So let me. I got and, a question. And, and, and one last thing, and, and, and it's not about the IQ. Um, of course, they no. It's not have, about that. At all. They might they might have the uh, the acumen to play it because they played the sport at a high level, even at a WNBA level or something like that. So it's not so much as of that. It just have more to do with the dynamic of a uh, man and woman in a male dominated sport. Go ahead, Crutch. Okay, yeah, I got a question for you and Poppy. So